kerosene heater might be to blame for an early morning fire that forced two Dayton families out of their homes. Maytal Levy is live on East 2nd Street with what firefighters are saying. Good morning, Brooke. Dayton firefighters spent several hours this morning clearing up this fire here, and this is what it looks like now. And they say to blame is the kerosene heater sitting in front right here. We know the residents tried to heat the home up using gasoline. Now, when we got on scene, firefighters were inside battling the flames and the sp smoke. I spoke with a man and woman who live on the right side of the duplex. They say they just woke up to those bright orange flames and are now looking for their missing gray kitten. Dozens of neighbors have come out showing their concern and support for the families. Kind of like of an explosion and we ran out to see what was going on and uh, we just wanted to make sure that the other half a double, the people that was in the half a double was out outside of the house. Red Cross has come out to help both of those families and fire officials say we've been pretty lucky with the weather. So when you start heating up your homes with those kerosene heaters, space heaters, turning on those furnaces to be extra careful in Dayton, Maytal Levy, 2 News Today, working for you.